Do you want to live forever? Well, rapamycin, an anti-cancer and anti-aging drug, brings humanity a step closer to this reality. The key to all its success involves how it targets the mTOR protein complex. Think of mTOR like the general contractor of every process of building a cell. After you eat, mTOR senses the available nutrients and sends signals telling cells to build new proteins, new enzymes, fat stores, basically activating the entire process of cell growth and multiplication. When you consume sugar and protein, mTOR becomes overly active and this process speeds up and everyone's super productive, but this also causes cancer and aging. Cancel tour. No, we can't cause each organism will die. This happens naturally when you fast. mTOR senses the lack of calories, making cell processes hunker down, slowing cell growth. Kind of like how a contractor gets funding cuts and temporarily slows down building production. When rapamycin inhibits mTOR, it mimics calorie restriction in fasting and allows autophagy. Damaged old proteins are cleaned out or recycled into new tissue. Cells using old nutrients as fuel that will allow them to survive just a little bit longer. Less cell growth equals less aging and a lesser chance of cell overgrowth that leads to cancer. Thomas, those studies agree that rapamycin is currently our best candidate for life extension therapy. Pioneering a world where we'll all live much longer and healthier lives. And maybe one day, we will live forever.